I am Rachel Zakachansky. I'm tough, I'm strong, and I am fast. That very first time she crossed the finish line and she won. She's standing on the field, completely confident. Everybody's congratulating her. She's taking it all in. She's not worried about having a seizure. She's not worried about, did she take her medicine this morning? She's not worried about anything else. And then in that moment, we weren't either. She has epilepsy. The seizure started when she was a baby, and she spent a lot of time in the hospital in her childhood. But she doesn't ever let it get in her way. I've been in Special Olympics since 2005, right when I was 15 years old. The more you practice, the more you play, the more you win. Her life stopped being just going to school, going to the doctors, going to physical therapy. <laughs> It expanded her life a lot more. These ones I got at district. These ones I got at state. She's in Special Olympics because she has a disability, but when she competes in Special Olympics, it's gone. My first ever Special Olympics Illinois event was the Effingham Polar Plunge. And I saw Rachel and her dad getting out into that freezing cold water and plunging. And the whole time she was smiling. Special Olympics Illinois provides opportunity to grow, develop friendships, improve their self-esteem, and really develop healthier lifestyles. Rachel is an athlete because of Special Olympics. She's a global messenger because of Special Olympics. She's a health messenger because of Special Olympics. These athletes are full of love and they have the best sportsmanship that you could possibly imagine. These athletes are empowering to the people around them. These athletes are inspirational. You, you should never quit and never give up. You should always keep trying, just never give up. Let me win, but if I cannot win, let me be brave in the attempt.